Prey is not a sequel, it's not a remake, it has no tie with the, with the original. It's, uh, you have to look at it like a, a reimagining of the, of the IP. You're on board of a, of a space station and there are aliens and you have to survive. Arcane has always the same values in terms of like the kind of games that we make. And a game that will be defined as an arcane game is a game where simulation is very important, where the choices of the players is very important. So we, uh, we track, we did that all, all along, we did all along so that there can be consequences to the choices. Uh, also, we give a lot of tools. And because it's all simulated, all those exploring those tools in the in the environment and against the different AIs who themselves are simulated, you know, they're on, they're not on a on a set path. So all these combined uh, really provide for experiences that are unique to each of the players. It's not horror. The psychological thrill dimension is more around the theme of identity. You know, who are you exactly? As Morgan, you. When we started the project. I wanted to call him or her, Morgan. Uh, the reason being, you can choose at the beginning of the game if you are, uh, if you want to play a female or male character. And Morgan, therefore, is an ideal name because it's gender neutral. Good morning, Morgan. Looks like we have some tests to run through today. The trailer shows uh, a very brief moment of encounter with aliens, and uh, it is important to note that it's not just shooting. It's uh, it's uh, it's more like a, a hybrid game where there's like narratives meet with action, meet with a little bit of RPG layer. So you, you have you have some weapons, but you also have lots of other things, including, web, uh, including the powers that you can learn from the aliens themselves. The way you fight aliens is uh, by either using uh, weapons that are on board of the station, because there, there is an entire security on board, so it's logical that there are some weapons. But also you will find some gadgets, because it's a scientist area, so there's a lot of uh, interesting gadgets that you can use that are not meant for combat but somehow uh, work out in combat. If you like arcane games, uh, those, those games that blend narratives and simulations and you know, some, some, some choices and, and uh, a lot of player exploration, Prey is going to be that game for you.